this girl. Think about it twice before posting it on social media. Welcome back to AFOX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now at this point, Davido needs to just have a reality show between him and his women. The United States side chick Anita Brown has been calling out Chioma, dragging her through this mess. She said that she was also a side chick just as she was. She stole Davido from one of his baby mamas, also putting out that Chioma cheated on Davido with his friend, probably even slept with one of his family, that is Clark Adeleke. I mean, I shared that video with you guys. You can check it out, catch up. She really said some very, very nasty stuff, even blaming the passing of Davido and Chioma's son, Ifanyi to vengeance from god for the video being a bad father while the other side chick the french one has stepped into the picture right now to defend their baby daddy. She is putting out that Davido is a good man asking the USA side chick to please take it slow with calling out Shioma. She doesn't deserve this. She shouldn't be dragged into this mess and I want us to listen to Ivana Bay requesting Anita to stop putting all these things on social media before she regrets it. And she also puts this tagging her, mom, you're going too far. Be quiet, please. Respect other relationships, even if you disagree. She's still the wife and a mother and a woman. You are being mean. Even if he has a bad behavior, you know well he is a good person and a good man after all. Nobody deserves this. So French side chick is putting out that our man is a good man. He is a good person and doesn't deserve this at all. Even though she also came out calling Davido out, is he planning to have a football match? How many people is he sleeping with? Is he not fearful of diseases? But despite all that, she does know that this is a good person and a good man after all. Let's listen to the address that she has for USA side chief. Okay, I understand that you can be upset that it's one thing to, to drag out a man who got you pregnant and had a bad behavior with you. I understand that. I really understand it, like, I'm on the same um, level, but it's really mean to, to talk about a woman who doesn't do a shit to you, she doesn't even know you, like, she, she don't care about you, you see, and to talk about her like that, and to talk about their relationship that you don't even know about, man, you don't need that, it's just bad beauty, and it's so mean, like, you don't even know what she's gone through, what she's ha handling now, so... Don't, don't do that much. You don't need that. We understand that you got pregnant. You're not the only one. We know, but chill. I look at your story and the word that you're using, it's so mean. Like, it's useless. You don't need that. It's so mean, girl. Like, you will regret it. Just look at what you said. You're talking about employment women and all that stuff. And then you're dragging her out, calling how they're talking about her in her bag. Do you really think she wants to see that? She need that? Ma'am, stop. Stop. It's, that's too much. That, that's awful. Like, it's me. I really think that now we don't need to talk about all that anymore. We don't need to, to, to get through all that anymore. Like, it's going too far. That's something that we shouldn't share. You understand what I mean? Like we all have stuff, we all have things to say, but that's something that you shouldn't talk about publicly. You should not talk about that. It's going too far, it's too private, and you will get a lot of uh, bad things for that because you can't, you can't talk about private life of somebody that much and, and be happy. Like, it's your private life too, but it's his and it's hers and you need to respect that they are humans they are not like just a uh, robot who uh in your life they are humans human feelings they are like you and me and they can get hurt too so please just think about that but i understand that you want to talk about your pregnancy like people will see it and they will know that you are pregnant and they will know who got you pregnant that you can you can hide that forever you can talk about that that it's fair it's it's yours it's your body it's your bump it's your child too it's fair but all the other stuff you are talking about that's bullshit that's really 
bullshit. See, I, really not, I am really not judging you. I don't want to be mean either. I just hope that God gives you a forgiving heart and that he will give you a chill and, and calm and he will appease your heart because it's so bad for your child. It's so bad when you're pregnant to be in this type of mood. And I know what I'm talking about. Like, you know, hormones and all that stuff play a lot on your mood. But please, girl, think about it twice before posting it on social media. Despite defending the baby daddy, Davido, Ivana is taking the support seriously. You can hear Davido's songs playing on the background. So someone says here, Davido and his baby mama need their own reality show. Now at this point, I absolutely agree with that as well. Someone else says, Real Housewives of Adeleke. Another comment here reads, This is the main cloud chaser here, sees her. Someone else asks, What did David get himself into? Ah, side chick get conscience oh wow and another comment here reads what i see here is that this ivana girl wants to play favorite if you really care about david reputation so much why come out with this pregnancy shit why not stay on a low key and give birth to your child like larissa oh my god david what have you done look at the monsters you made somebody also says all of you and your baby daddy should get out enough why david was jump playing in the the background this baby mamas get wahala lol now at this point i think this is where you say you really have to be careful the person that you choose as a partner even as a side chick because what we're clearly seeing right now is a total mess there is no conscience there is no shame in this expose these women do not mind going through the mud at whatever expense at this point they are all to blame if you're not ready to be a mother then why let yourself get pregnant in the first place did you have a conversation with this man get to know if he wants to have children with you did you discuss protection with this man and if not what measures did you take to protect yourself honestly they don't seem to be innocent as they would like to make it look wrap today thanks so much for watching subscribe hit the notification bell so you'll be the first to be notified once you have any new uploads catch you on the next one bye bye